as if I didn't have enough problems. Who said that? Just much. That's the first time. About the plants. If you cannot handle that by yourself, you won't be any good as an alchemist either. I've got all the plants I was supposed to bring you. What? You're pulling my leg right by Adonos. It's all there, all right. Who knows? Maybe someday you could make a decent alchemist after all. I want to sign up with one of the other masters. You have come to ask my approval? Hmm. As far as I'm concerned, you can sign up with whoever you like. I want to start as your apprentice. Eh, great. You seem to know the basics already. Harrod thinks you're a good man. Thorben gave you his blessing. I'm not all that pious, but I'm fine with it. Constantino says you can sign up wherever you want for all he cares. And Matteo says you're worth your weight in gold. This means you have the approval of all masters. You can work for me at any time if you want. I'm in. You aren't going to regret this. I think we'll be able to work together well. What are my tasks as an apprentice? That's easy. Bring me as many pelts as you can get. I'll pay you a better price for them than any of the other traders would give you. Apart from that, you needn't show up here in the shop. I can get along just fine by myself. And where am I supposed to sleep? I don't have any room for you here. They're bound to have a bed for you in the hotel at the marketplace. Show me your wares.
never asks me. Hey, you! I have talked to Baltram. He will find someone to relieve you. Ah, very good. Then we can finally leave here. You had better keep my aquamarine ring for now. I assume it will come in handy for you until you get your own. Okay, let's go. Where? Let us take Vatris's ornament back. Then let's go. Follow me. Hey, you! Lares said that you could help me get into the Monastery of the Fire Magicians. Is that your choice? The way of the fire? Yes, I want to become a fire magician. As far as I know, they gladly accept novices in their monastery. So why would you need my help? Lares mentioned that they demand a tribute before they let anyone into the monastery. I cannot grant you entry into the monastery myself. I am a water mage, as you know, but I am very well acquainted with Darren, the fire magician. He spends most of his time in the marketplace, collecting alms for his church. But I have heard that he is not only in town to raise some funds. He told me about a statuette that was stolen from him. It was very important to him. He will surely allow you to enter the monastery if you can get it back for him. Of course, if you should decide to join the Circle of Fire, you can still become a member of the Ring. If you prove yourself worthy, that is. Can you heal me? Adonis, bless this body. Free it of its wounds and strengthen it with new life. Nothing, Nothing there. to be had there. Nothing to be had there.
Now that we're no longer in town and cannot be overheard, let me tell you a little more. We are now going to take this ornament that you brought me back to Satyrus. You remember Satyrus, don't you? Certainly. He was the leader of the water mages in the new camp. We lads from the former new camp still have good relations with the water mages. Even Lee will still protect the water mages against any danger today if it's within his power. To keep up the contact with the water mages, I'm in town most of the time, working together with Vatris. And this is the armor that is issued to each of us by the water mages. The members of the Ring of Water have been wearing such armor since before the Orc Wars. What is Cavalorn's part in this? He wasn't a follower of the new camp as far as I know. You are right. Our community has grown. Even I do not know how many there are by now. But let us move on. I want to get further away from the city. We can talk more about it later. Let's move on. Stay close behind me. Nothing there. Come here, you filthy beast. One less monster around. get this open without the right key. What's the matter? What's the matter? Just look at that mess under the bridge over there. I haven't seen anything like it in my entire life. Those swine should be exterminated, I tell you. What happened? I was traveling with my helpers when those horrible brutes came jumping on my cart out of the blue and butchered everybody. I'm lucky that I still know how to dish out a decent right hook, or they would have killed me too. Who were those people? The bandits. Who else? They took over the bridge up there. They rob everybody who tries to pass the bridge. I knew they were lurking up there, so I passed under the bridge instead. But my cart and my goods must have been too tempting for them. Those scumbags simply jumped from the bridge directly onto my cart. Uh, I should have tried to steal past in the night. That stuff there under the bridge is yours? The cart, the goods, everything. Look, I collected some of your stuff for you. You can keep it. None of it is really of any value to me. The only thing that's irreplaceable are the three stone tablets they stole from me. Stone tablets? The water mage in town wants to buy them from me, and I promised he'd get them. 
I must have them back at any cost, or my reputation will be tarnished. What would a water mage want with them? He said he was going to study them, and asked me to bring him more. Where did you get those stone tablets? I found them near old buildings, such as mausoleums, or sometimes in caves. I've already sold a whole bunch of them to the water mages in town. They're pretty rare down here, though. I found most of them northeast of Corinus. Why don't you simply go looking for new ones? Uh, during that melee with the bandits, I sprained my ankle. I can still hobble along, but I don't want to walk very far on this foot. Are you a citizen of the town? Haven't been in ages, boy. There's no love lost between me and the corrupt swine in the upper quarter of Corinus. I used to have quite a bit of influence there, you know, but that was months ago. You managed to drive back the bandits? Yes, but I'm sure they're still up there on the bridge. Can you teach me how to hit hard like that? <laughs> of course I can. About those stone tablets, what about this one then? No. This kind of stone tablet is magically charged. Alas, the water mage won't buy this kind of tablet. Show me how I can hit harder. All right, but you'll owe me for that. Help me save my reputation and bring back my stone tablets. Then I can show you how to make better use of your strength in combat. Show me how I can hit harder. All right, but you'll owe me. Help me save that. Show me your wares. I can't sell you anything. All my stuff lies over there, under the bridge, lad. I can only sell you something once I get home, but I won't leave here until I have my stone tablets back. What's wrong? Are you still holding up? That fellow over there has problems with bandits. Too bad for him, but we don't have time for that now. Let's move on. Stay close behind me. So much for you, filthy beast. Nothing to be had there. Don't you break down on me now. Stop blabbing. Let's move on. Stay close behind me.
so much for you. Less monster there. around. Nothing to plunder. Nothing to be had there. The water majors are all beside themselves. They've been digging at an excavation site in the northeast for weeks. It's anybody's guess what they're trying to find there. It all started when the earth began trembling like it did in the worst times of the barrier. Horrible stone creatures emerged from the ground, slaying everyone who went within a hundred feet of them. The water mages took the matter in hand and destroyed those hostile invaders. And now they're digging down there, searching for an explanation for these strange events. But you will soon see for yourself. Let's move on. Stay close behind me. One less mo Nothing there to be had there. Can you still go on? Yeah, yeah. Let's move on. Stay close behind me. Nothing there.
night. It could get dangerous here. Let's move on. Keep back a little. Come here, you filthy beast. Nothing there. We're here. Here, take the ornament. The water mages must be in there somewhere. Take it to them. If you should meet any beasts down in that hole in the ground that look like they're too much for you, flee forward to Satyrus. He'll take care of the beasts for you. I need to go back. And one more thing. Don't even think about strolling around for long with this ornament. Go directly to Satyrus. See you.